Ton of work to be done outside. We've had a lot of unexpected events happen in the last six months and we've definitely taken a lot of time to really sit back and say where we want to be moving forward. We love this house and we're not necessarily eager to sell it. We're going to throw cards on the table and see what happens for the future. We always have to stop in our journeys for ice cream. It's totally mandatory. Especially when it's salted. The entire exterior took us almost two weeks to complete, but we're really happy with the results. From all of that scraping of the old paint, as well as sanding and all new application of deck stain and exterior paint, and we went to town. We got all of the back done, the garden shed, as well as all three porches. It does take a lot of elbow grease, it does take a lot of work, but it is so rewarding when you're finished. If you ever need exterior paint stain and you need color matches, Benjamin Moore is fantastic. The paint cans that I had that were left in this house previously, so I had the color match, they were able to duplicate the exact color that I needed for the exact stain and paint that I needed.
All of that labor, all of that love, all of those layers, all of that scraping, all of the sanding was completely worth it. I did go over the top and I did get stuck. When I got up to that peak, when I was doing the red on the deck side, I guess I overestimated. When I went up, it didn't feel like it was that high when I got up there, and I guess the space was a little bit smaller than I anticipated. So trying to get back down, I definitely got stuck. I decided I'm just gonna use a roller for that top piece because when I got up, I, uh, I don't know what happened, but the space was so small when I wanted to turn to come back down, I, <laughs> I totally got stuck. I've really enjoyed the time here in the city looking at all of these gorgeous Victorian homes. And when I was out speaking with the real estate company, it was just fun to go and see all of the detail and have the privilege of putting the detail back into this home. It's been a lot of work, and when I say a lot, it's a lot, but it's worth it, and it looks so much better. The columns on the front porch were a challenge. We had to sand out the whole deck, we had to replace wood, we had to sand it back again, and there's a little frame at the bottom and Ryan had to recut all new wood because the wood was rotted out. But once we got everything done, I broke out all those colors, repainted everything, and it looked new again.
Thank you so much for watching this week's video. I'm really looking forward to seeing you soon. Until then, take care.